A practical pressure sensitive keyboard. In this work, we demonstrate a pressure sensitive keyboard which both looks and feels like an ordinary keyboard. It leverages existing keyboard manufacturing technology. A buckling rubber dome creates the tactile feel and presses on three flexible membranes. The membranes are printed with resistive carbon ink. When the dome collapses, it applies pressure to the top sheet, deforming it into the hole and thus making electrical contact. The greater the force, the greater the contact area, decreasing the resistance. Signal conditioning is provided by a pair of inexpensive quad op amps. The signals are measured utilizing the microprocessor's onboard 10-bit A to D converter. In this demonstration, the size and color of the on-screen key indicates the force level that has been applied. As you can see, this is a true multi-touch device. It measures the force on each key independently and essentially simultaneously. The keyboard can even be used as a low-resolution multi-touch sensor for gesture recognition. We next consider the use of the pressure-sensitive keyboard in gaming applications. Here, key force determines the rate of movement and the height of jumping. Most instant messaging applications allow users to change font, style, and size in order to better convey emotion. Unfortunately, this is impractical in a rapid conversation. In this demonstration, font size is proportional to key force. Thus, one can convey emotion instantaneously. Another feature of this demonstration is the overloaded backspace key. Pressing it lightly deletes a character at a time, while pressing it more forcefully deletes a word at a time. Pressure-sensitive keyboards may also be useful in helping to correct sloppy typing. In this case, I was attempting to type GOT, but accidentally hit the adjacent H key. The different pressure levels can help determine actual user intent.